Now let's look at the, another choice the firm needs to make, whether a firm should shut down in the short run. This turns out to be kind of a tricky question. We want to look at total revenue, variable cost, and, and how those things affect the shutdown decision. Now remember, in this industry where we're producing t-shirts, we had a total, we had a fixed cost of $17. And that's the amount that we're going to pay no matter whether we produce or not. And we want to keep that in mind when we're looking at this short run shutdown decision. So let's look at our cost curves. We've got a marginal cost curve here. Here's our average total cost, average variable cost. And we can look at different price levels and determine what the decision might be. Now remember, our, our break-even point is where the price is equal to the marginal cost at the bottom of average total cost. So that would be about here would be our break-even point. If the price is below that, we're going to lose money. If the price is above that, we're going to earn an economic profit. Let's look at one example. Suppose the price is equal to $4. So our marginal revenue is equal to $4. That crosses the marginal cost curve here at point A, producing four t-shirts per minute. Now, that $4 price is less than the average total cost of $750. So we would be generating a loss equal to $14. Now, that seems pretty bad. Producing and losing $14 seems like that's not maximizing profits. But, here's the question. If we produce four t-shirts per minute, we lose $14. Because remember, average total costs includes average variable costs and average fixed costs. So our total loss is going to be equal to $14. If you choose to produce zero, you still have to pay your fixed costs. So you'll lose $17. So the question you have to ask yourself, is it better to lose $14 or is it better to lose $17? In the short run, where we have to pay our fixed costs, it's better to lose $14. So when we want to maximize profits, sometimes that means minimizing losses. So when would a firm shut down in the short run? Well, as long as you're covering some of your variable costs, you, if you're covering all of your fixed costs and some of your variable costs, well, then you'll lose less money by operating than if you shut down. So as long as the price is greater than average variable cost, you'll want to stay open. Suppose, for example, the price were less than $3. If the price is less than $3, then we would see that price is less than average variable cost where we are producing. If that's the case, we're going to lose both our $17 and some more than $17. So we would want to shut down. In fact, in the short run, you shut down anytime the price is less than average variable cost. Which leads us to a rule of thumb. Operate if the price is greater than average variable cost. Shut down if the price is less than average variable cost. And the shutdown price is the price at which the firm is indifferent between operating and shutting down. In the short run, it's equal to the minimum of average variable cost.